Amendment 3 of the 17th edition introduced the requirement for cables in escape routes to be protected against premature collapse. The new regulation has now removed the term escape route, meaning that you've got to protect all cables against premature collapse. Ooh. Chapter 53, Protection, Isolation, Switching, Control and Monitoring. This has been completely revised and the number of regulations have increased significantly. This regulation in particular talks about unwanted tripping. It requires that the designer limit the amount of downstream current to not more than 30% of the RCD rating. Practically, this means a circuit with a 30 milliamp RCD shouldn't exceed 10 milliamps. Section 534 has been enhanced to give additional practical information about the connection of surge protection devices. Chapter 54, Earthing Arrangements and Protective Conductors. This regulation has now been modified and requires an earth electrode supplementing any earthing facility provided by the distributor. And for new buildings, the provision of foundation earthing is strongly recommended.